हेलो बच्चो लेट से क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन से डेट कंसिडर अ कार मूविंग अलॉन्ग स्ट्रेट हॉरिजॉन्टल रोड विथ अ स्पीड ऑफ सेवेंटी टू किलोमीटर पर आवर इफ द कोफिशेंट ऑफ स्टैटिक फ्रिक्शन बिटवीन द टायर्स एंड द रोड इज जीरो पॉइंट फाइव द शॉर्टेस्ट डिस्टेंस इन विच द कार कैन बी स्टॉप डिज टेकिंग जी इज इक्वल टू टेन मीटर पर सेकेंड स्क्वायर सो वील सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वील सी वट विल बी द की कंसेप्ट इज टू सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन the key concept that will be used to solve this question will be frictional force f is equal to mu into n where mu is the coefficient of friction and n is the normal reaction now also from equation of kinematics we have v square is equal to u square plus 2 a into s Where v is the final velocity, e is the initial velocity, a is the acceleration, and s is the distance for which the car has been traveled. Now we will see. Suppose this is a straight horizontal road, and the car is moving on this road. So suppose this is the car. Let us assume that this is the car. Okay, the car is moving on this road. And the acceleration of the car. We have to find the first the acceleration of the car. Initial speed of the car is given at e is equal to seventy two kilometer per hour, and the coefficient of static friction between car tires of the car and road is mu is equal to zero point five. So, if the car is moving in this direction with an acceleration a, so friction will be acting. In this direction, sorry, car is moving in this direction with velocity u. So friction will be acting in opposite direction, and as friction is the only force, so F will cause retardation. Retardation. So the frictional force that will be equal to mu into n. N is weight of the car. That is weight of the car will be equal to mg. Weight of the car will be equal to mg. And normal reaction will be equal to weight of the car that will be equal to mg. So frictional force that will be equal to mu mg. So it's retardation of car. A is retardation, so it will be negative. So A will be equal to minus mu mg by m. That is force by mass. Here we are taking minus sign because it is retardation and it will try to stop the car. So this will be equal to minus mu g. Now mu is zero point five and g is ten meter per second square. So a will be equal to minus five meter per second square. Now for car to stop, we will have v is equal to zero and u is given as seventy two kilometer per hour. So we will change it in meter per second. So to change kilometer per hour in meter per second, we multiply by five by eighteen. So this will be twenty meter per second. So applying the for equation of kinematics, v square is equal to u square plus two a s. We will have v square that is zero that will be equal to twenty square plus two into a h minus five into s. We have to find the shortest distance of on which the car will be stopped. So we will have ten s is equal to four hundred or s is equal to Forty meter. So the required distance is forty meter, which is option B. So this will be the correct option. Hope you all understood it well. Best of luck.